Who was Luqman? According to many of the great scholars, and companions, and tabi'i, and the report coming in to reflect this, Yahya ibn Sa'id al-Ansari, he said that on, on the authority of Sa'id ibn Musayyib, rahimahullah, that Luqman belonged to the black people of Egypt, we now know as Nubians. He belonged to the Nubian people. And Almighty Allah granted him wisdom, but not prophethood. And so Luqman, rahimahullah, according to the stories of, of the Qur'an by Hafiz ibn Kathir, rahimahullah, Luqman, he was described as a perceptive man, always watching animals and plants in his surroundings. And he tried to understand the world based on what he saw. So if he lived today, and he saw what was happening to the climate, and he saw that over 50% of mammals and birds have been destroyed, he would be in great stress. Back to the report. One day while sleeping under a tree, he was inspired by Allah and informed that he would be given a gift, either kingdom to be a great king or to be a knowledgeable person. And so he chose knowledge. And when he woke from his slumber, he became aware that his senses and his understanding had sharpened. He felt in complete harmony with nature and could understand the inner meaning of things beyond their physical reality. Immediately, he prostrated to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and he thanked Allah azza wa for this mighty gift.